This morning, concerns for a young female Iranian athlete after she competed without wearing a hijab. El Naz Rakabi, a prominent rock climber, took part in a competition in South Korea this weekend, notably climbing with her head uncovered. In the past, Rakabi has worn the traditional headscarf while climbing. The hijab has been a focus of recent extraordinary protests in Iran, sparked by the death of 22-year-old Masa Amini, who was detained by the morality police for breaching the dress code. She died three days later. Women across Iran have protested by cutting their hair and appearing in public with their heads uncovered. After the appearance in South Korea, Rakabi is headed home. The Iranian embassy in Seoul tweeting, she departed yesterday. Human rights groups have been concerned about pressure she may face from authorities. I think they will put her under tremendous pressure. There is fear of torture, ill treatment, psychological pressure. They want to set an example, both for other athletes in the same situation and also for the Iranian girls, so that they don't get a role model in El Nas. Rukabi this morning posting on Instagram that her hijab had issues before she was called to climb. While the statement was posted on her account, the circumstances under which it was posted remain unclear. Now, back in Iran, the regime has been under pressure as protests led by young women continue, many watching Rukabi's return to the country with concern. Now, the International Federation of Sports Climbing says it's in contact with Rokabi. They also say they're in contact with the Iranian Climbing Federation. They released a statement that I want to read to you. They say athlete safety is paramount for us. The IFSC fully supports the right of athletes, their choices, and expression of free speech. But, Savannah, of course, this is a story that we're going to be watching closely. All right, Megan Fitzgerald, thank you very much. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.